All right. Okay. So, um, so as you can see, um, right. Well, for the no people who have ever, uh, or who, uh, who watch my, you know, watch my stuff, uh, this won't be on the, uh, uh, this won't be on stream. Um, I ended up, uh, off stream grinding a little bit and trying to do some of this area um just off stream to try and you know see uh what i could do what i could accomplish and whatnot and um i have uh yeah um i've ended up with the uh the final boss or what i think is i shouldn't say that i think is the final boss i don't know um so yeah um Uh, so here I am. I do not know uh, whom. Like I'm, I'm guessing we fight. Like I would assume Mikula, but uh, what, what Mikula gonna look like when um, he gave up like all of himself? So I'm not quite sure what that means. A anyways, um, so. Uh, go over the build a little bit. Um, yeah, I, I, at this point, kind of, uh, you know, I've leveled up. Um, not, you know, like, uh, I, I abandoned the whole, like, oh, stay one level 150 a while ago. Um, I'm at Blessing 18. Um, I confess, I don't really know, um... Like, without looking it up, I'm not sure where um, other stuff is. Um, I will also say I don't know, um, like, since there's, you know, I can see on the map there's a, like, a map marker. So, I, I'm assuming there's a way to get down here, but that's not apparent. So, I've looked around, like, all these sort of edge areas that I can think of. Um, so, I don't know how to get down there. I'm... You know, I, I'm sorry, I don't, you know, uh, I might futz around and try and do it off stream, but, um, and then, yeah, I haven't gone into some of the gowls and stuff like that, and, uh, I basically ignored Ford Reprimand, because I just didn't seem important, um, and yeah, I'm not gonna bother, uh, trying to go into any more of the forges, because they just take too long. Um, but yeah, um, so... Here we are, um, and, uh, I don't know how long, uh, yeah, the other reason I figured I wouldn't try streaming this is because I technically don't know how long this will be, so, um, we're gonna, like, not to say I will on one shot, because like I said, I don't even know, uh, this, this has been here the whole time, I don't know, like, who's on the other side of that, so, or, I don't know what the boss is like, so I'm gonna, uh, Yeah, I'm I'm doing this blind, you know, for the first time for uh, for this recording, but um, hey! oh, there, Tholier. Okay. All right, let's go. Oh, okay. My loyal blade and champion of the festival. Champion of the festival. Both Wait. Your deeds will ever be praised in song. What? Now, the vow will be honored, and my lord brother's soul will return. Wait, Godwin. No, wait. Wait, Radon. Wait, is that Radon? Wait, why are. What? What? Okay, I have. So many questions. Like, 
you know, why? What? Okay. Um. Uh. Oh God. Okay. Cool. Wow, okay. Ow, whoa, okay. Sir, you deal all the damage. Woo, okay. Woo -hoo -hoo. Whoa! Ow, okay. Oh my, what the hell happened there? Okay. Oh my god, dude, what the hell? Oh wow, okay, that does nothing. Okay, that's... It's really cool that there's tons of effects in this fight that you can't dodge. That's that's really well designed. Huh. Okay, I mean, I'm already out of heals, so... Like, I know I'm failing this. Um... I'm sorry, Tholier, you, you don't seem to be helping. Um, ow, okay. Um, so yeah, I think if I'm summoning someone, I'm summoning someone who can help. Um, no offense. And, yeah, I think that's what we're gonna do, because, uh, yeah. Um, yeah, I will do, like, a, like, a final thoughts thing, um, after all of this, but, um, um, I do have, like, this This also follows, like, I have criticisms of the, uh, of the DLC, um, and this is kind of one of them where it's, everything is, uh, like, just, um, yeah, the, I don't want to say, oh, everything is too difficult. It's everything in the DLC feels just a little too punishing. Where everything has, like, a little too much health, a little too much armor. Hey! Oh. Uh, yeah, that's my, like, I think, I think it's fair criticism, right? Like, it's... Okay, he didn't like that. Okay, why did that fucking hit me? I still... I'm still missing something as to why we're fighting Rudon. Like, I don't... Oh. Let's... 
getting angry. What? What's? What's going on? Why are we? Oh, gate's gone. Lord brother. At long last, you are returned. Okay. I'm guessing that's Mikola. Tarnished one. Aspiring Lord of the Old Order. If you have known sin, if you grieve for this world, then yield the path forward to us. So we got a twin princes going? What's... Huh? Oh god! Ah! No! Bad timing! Bad timing! Ow! Ah! What the... F whoa! 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 What the fuck? How is that fucking okay? What the fuck was that? Woo! Ow! Ow! What the? Whoa! <laughs> what is this even? Woo! Okay. That I can pretty consistently dodge, but... Whoa! Oh, nope. Uh, okay, I have no healing left. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, this, like, how is, how is, how are the damage numbers in these fights okay? Right? Like, like, I can barely, like, almost every attack that he throws out, I need to, like, I need to heal or I die. Right? Like, that's, it... <sighs> And this is part of why I almost didn't even want to uh, do this, is because I don't feel... Okay, like, first off, I'm guessing, because of all that light, it's holy damage, so I'll put that on. Um, but um, this is probably my biggest criticism with the, uh, uh, the DLC, is... Um, everything just deals way... just deals too much damage. I'm sorry, it's... It's, uh, like, oh, uh, flasks. Um, we need to go the other way because every time he hits me, I need to heal, which is bullshit. But that's the way the DLC works. Yeah, and we're just gonna summon someone else. Free healing on me. I don't need free healing. Um, sure. We'll, we'll try you. Um, hell, I might even... Sure, why not? I will summon Melania to fight Radon. The irony is not lost on me. Hey! And I'll... Wait, I'll summon Radon to fight Radon? Is that what... Yeah. Unable to summon cooperator. Okay. Uh, okay. Where's my... Yeah. Woo! Okay. Whoa, okay, this guy deals way more damage than me, holy crap. Whoa! Ah, what the? I don't, I don't, I don't, ah, okay.
Okay. Okay, I didn't want to end up all the way over here, dude, but okay. Um, okay, so I can skip this. I have so many lore questions. Um, like, that! Ah! Woo! Uh, I don't know what that was, but I don't like this! Run away! Ow! Okay, I call bullshit game, but okay. Ah! Why still me?! Oh my god! Fuck off! Okay. Woo! Oh my god! What is going on? Holy! That's not... No, that's not fair game. <laughs> Okay, Okay, I'm really- it's- it's really glad to know that you can't fucking evade that. That's fucking annoying. Like... Yeah, uh, to be honest, I don't even know if I'll bother, uh, posting this recording. Um, this, like, I don't, I don't think this is extremely entertaining. Um, but I also, like I kind of said, I, I don't feel like the DLC is well balanced. Um, this boss does, the, the amount of damage this boss deals is not fair. Oh, okay. Um... Peace. Okay, no, oh, no, never mind. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Enable the okay, well <laughs> Sure, Mormon time. Okay, and I'm gonna need somebody else. Um Okay. Hey. Okay, let's try this again. Because, like I said, I'm... I don't find this... Okay. Like, exactly that. Like, I have 60 vigor. Fuck off. Oh god, why is he still fucking attacking me? I haven't hit him! Oh my, what the fuck? 
Okay, I think I hit him. Okay. Yeah, see, like, shit like that, that's not okay. Ah! What the fuck? <laughs> oh my god, why is he attacking me? Yeah, the aggro in some of these whatevers doesn't make any fucking sense. Oh my god! Uh, fuck! What? Yeah, the, the, the fact that, like, bosses will just, like, randomly attack you when you haven't even fucking hit them, like, it... Yeah, the, uh... This DLC especially, um, uh, the bosses don't seem to, uh, do, like, they don't seem to handle aggro properly, and it's, uh, you know, it, it's very, um, very fucking annoying, where, like, no matter what you do, bosses will just be like, no, I'm attacking you, and, like, they... Bosses seem to, like, know, like, oh, I just kill you, right? And it's, like, I don't find it very fun. Um, so, yeah, I'm just going to keep summoning people till people can carry me through this, because this is just, this is just bullshit. Like, stuff like that, where it's like, okay, I wasn't the last person to hit him, and... Whoa! Okay. Okay. Oh my, what the fuck? Haven't fucking hit him in fucking ages. Why does he fucking, like, what? Stuff like that, where it's like, I wasn't even fucking hitting him, and all of a sudden he's like, no, you. Like, it makes no fucking sense. No. Oh my- why? Why fucking me? Oh, get out. Okay. I always thought that was a pull, but apparently it's also a push. Uh, okay. Okay, I think I missed. Ha <laughs> ha Why? 
Wait, did he heal? I thought he was lower health before. Ow! ow what the fuck? Oh my god! Fuck off! Okay, well, Bub's down. Ooh, okay, not... Uh, okay. It's another nuke. So he can do that more than once. Okay, uh, apparently I can also miss that. <laughs> Why? What the fuck? I'm getting really fucking sick of just random fucking aggro getting thrown at me. Okay. I also think I'm not hurting him. Okay. Oh, fuck off! I dodged that and you fucking know it, game. Yeah, I, I also think, um, to use, uh, like, to, to sort of give away some of my thoughts early. Um, I like um, Asmogold's analogy of uh, Dark Souls is one of those games that asks you to, like, you know, make four, but it doesn't care how you make it. A lot of the DLC feels like, okay, but, you know, you have to make four, but we're adding a minus one on this end, or we're, you know... Like, we're adding a three on this one. You know what I mean? Like, there, there's a lot of, um... Uh, it, it feels like there's a, like, very large amount of... Oh, who are you? Can I summon you? No, okay. Who did I summon? Uh, unable to touch... Okay. Oh, pardon me. Um, it, yeah, like, it, it feels like, um, the DLC almost, like, forces certain types of, like, play styles or, um, hey, wait, why can't I, what's, what's going on? Why can't I touch summon signs? Okay. Okay, the fuck is going on? Okay, I can't quit. <laughs> Unable to summon? Okay. Is it because I was trying to summon someone? Okay. No, sorry, Tolier. Um, I literally don't care. Um, I, I tried summoning you, Tolier. You, uh... You, you, unfortunately, I'm gonna fail, I guess I'm gonna fail that quest because you, you are no help in that boss fight, so. <laughs> hey! Hey! I disagree, game. Fuck you. That's fucking bullshit, and you fucking know it.
yeah, this is... I'm... I'm sorry. I, I don't enjoy this. Um, that's the other reason that I, I'm not even sure if I'm going to... Uh, uh, gonna release this. I might not even fucking bother beating this. Like, it's... This is... This does not feel balanced. It doesn't feel fair. Um, this encounter feels uh, very forced in terms of, like, what you need to do to, to like, accomplish this fight. And that, to me, is, like, antithetical to what a lot of these games are, is um, that, like, you know... No, I'm not summoning my again. You, you're not... No, I'm sorry, you're not helpful. Crimson can't, okay. Um, already been summoned by someone else. Got it, okay. Um, Ice Spear, nope, okay. Uh, okay, go on, got it. Summon you. No Mimic Run? Okay, I mean... But... Yeah, um, and this isn't just me saying this, I want to be clear, because, oh, I'm, you know, failing at DLC fights and shit like that. No, it's almost every encounter, every boss in the DLC, uh, feels like all the enemies have way too much health, they deal way too much damage, and you don't. Like, you just do not, you know... What is, what are you fucking talking about, game? I was fucking behind him, and he fucking hit me. Are you fucking serious? Like, what is this hitbox? Okay. Like, we got him here really fast. Uh, I'm just running away, because, uh, I know that that, like... <laughs> oh my god, leave me alone! Oh, okay. I don't know what the fuck that was. Ah! Why? Why? <laughs> See, shit like this. Why is he attacking me? The last person to attack him is someone else. Like... Oh! Whoop! Ow! Yeah. Ooh, okay, that hurt. Please stop, jackass. <laughs> Woo! Okay, I think I missed. Let's go! Fuck you, game! Remembrance of a god and a lord.
Okay. Uh, ooh, what's this? Let us go together. Oh. Touch memory. Oh. What? Circle of Light. Okay. Uh, the Circle of Light which adorned Mikola's head as he returned in divine aspect. It, had, it has begun to fade into nothingness. Ooh. Slightly boosts in faith in Arcane, while also boosting the power of Mikola's light. What the hell is Mikola's light? Uh, the Circle... Uh, was to be the very foundation upon which Mikola's age of compassion would be built, should it have, should it have ever come to pass. Okay. Remembrance of Radon, consort of Mikola, hewn into the Skadu tree. Uh, the power of its namesake can be unlocked at finger readers. Okay. In their childhood, Mikola saw in Radon a lord, his strength and his kindness that stood in stark contrast uh, with their afflicted selves. And so Mikola made his heartfelt wish that Radon would be, would one day be his king consort. See, I won't lie. For me, this feels like it comes out of left field, right? Like, not to, you know, like, I, I confess I'm not, you know, a big war nerd or whatever, so, um, I, like, uh, this bit, like, the whole thing with Radon, not, like, it, it doesn't quite feel like it makes a ton of sense, um, but, uh, because, like, when they were saying, like, oh, we're bringing someone back, I was like, you know, my first thought was, like, wait, God, like, are we bringing Godwin back? Like, you know, because that seems like what, um, you know, that, that seems kind of like who the, uh, um, like who the person he'd be trying to bring back was, which, I mean, would have been an interesting fight, right? Because if all of a sudden he, uh, you know, what happens if he brings back Godwin, right? Because now Godwin is like the first Lord of the Dead, right? Or something you know what i mean so that all of a sudden you know like i don't know that i th i thought that would have narratively been uh, been interesting but um uh how many souls did you give me that's oh, not even enough for a level up okay um well why don't we Go back to the round table, see what I can get for that, and then uh, I'll probably give, uh, you know, give give a summary of final thoughts, and then uh, we can call it for the video here. Um, so yeah, let's see what I can get. Um, young Lion's Helm. Golden Helm worn by Radon in his younger years. Proudly displays, um, oh, displaying his heroic red hair. It is fitting attire for a lion. When Melania 
uh, Blade and Mikola let the rot flower blossom in Aeonia, Rodan heard a murmur in his ear. Mikola awaits the O promised consort. Heard a more yeah, okay. Basic god free, okay. I do notice it's got weird horns on it though. Is that because they used Moog's body? Yeah, I, I, like I said, I still don't, um, oh, wait, this is three? Um, okay. Radon, Greatsword, yeah, Greatsword of Radon Lord, Greatsword of Radon Light, and Light of Mikula, Faith 72, Annihilate Foes with a Pillar of Light, okay, um, uh, great swords of black steel wielded by Radon in his youth. A pair of weapons decorated with a lion mane motif. These were in his possession immediately before his triumph over the stars. The swords of a lord who does not rely on physical strength and gravity alone. Okay. Unique seal promised consort. Imbue the two great swords with the light of Mikola, then deliver a slashing attack comprising, comprised by columns of light. Additional input allows for up to two follow-up attacks. Huh, that's interesting. I mean, I don't have the stats to wield them, and I never will, so... Um, okay, but what's the difference? Light speed slash. Okay, so they have a different... So they have different Ashes of War? Little by Radon. Unique skill, light speed slash. Assume a luminous form and leap for... Toward, oh, leap forward to deliver a downward slash at the speed of light. This attack can be followed up uh, by an additional light attack charge to increase power of the skill and number of follow-up attacks. Huh. I mean, yeah, like, again, that's interesting. I don't have the stats to use it, so I'm not gonna. Um, light of Mikola. The strength of Mikola upon his deific return, wielded as an incantation, annihilates foes with a pillar of light. Mikola sought uh, to accept all that was and would be, but found one that refused to be embraced. No wonder, as one god and one king consort is all the world needs. One god and one king consort is all the world needs. Huh. Oh, is, this, is that line, last line then talking about... Um... Or trying to say that, like, oh, you know what it is? Uh, found one that would refuse to be embraced. That's because, uh, technically, I'm already an Elden Lord. Technically, like, I'm an Elden Lord, and, like, Ronnie is my, um, you know, Ronnie, uh, like, I'm Ronnie's consort. So, I'm guessing that's what they're talking about? Um... Maybe? Okay. So, uh... Okay. So, I'm gonna, uh, do what I always do, and, uh... Oh, um, here. Just because I want to show it off. think I have? I do. Okay. Uh, where are you? Okay. Stand still, buddy. Oh, that's a... Huh. That's, uh, that's not bad. Um, now, that's a long, like, you know, that is a capital L long cast, but...
Huh. I don't hate it. Like, it... I won't lie. Um, it's not great. Um... Like, it's not a great, uh... Sort of, uh... It's, it's not going to be a great spell against, I hate to say it, like a lot of the DLC bosses, it's not going to be great. Also, I'm guessing it's holy damage, which, you know, like, also doesn't really, uh, um, uh, like, doesn't really, sorry, uh, getting, getting sidetracked. Um, uh, there's a lot of stuff in the game especially like early on and then late um that resists holy damage oh hey buddy layers hidden needle the layers mask the layers garb gloves trousers all right buddy um so i'm gonna you know what I'm going to go see if St. Trina has anything to say because I stopped Mikola, if St. Trina is even still here. Um, but. Oh, I don't think so. I think St. Trina has died. St. Trina's Blossom. Yeah, okay. So I'm guessing... Uh, St. Trina died when, uh, when Mikola did. That's, yeah, that's unfortunate. Oh yeah, I've seen a bunch of PvP videos talking about how the, uh, yeah, the, like, the eternal sleep stuff is really, uh, really nasty in PvP. Oh, the Lear's Mask increases Arcane. Huh. Okay. Oh. Wait, the armor does too? Or the... Yeah, the chest piece and the mask increase Arcane. That's kind of neat. Oh, that's a lot of immunity as well. Holy. Okay. And then St. Trina's Blossom. St. Trina's life withered and fell as... As fleeting as the seasons, at her last, she left a single water lily. Slightly boosts max FP. Oh, that's nice. Uh, despite the velvety purple hue, the flower is in no way poisonous. It merely blossoms in quietude. Minus 8 pierce, or minus 0.8 pierce. Well, it, it's a flower. It doesn't really, uh... You know, that, it's understandable that, uh... Probably wouldn't have any, uh, yeah. Here, let's, let's do it in here. Um, this seems like a, a fine place. Just, you know, rest in the quiet here and, uh, uh, gesture. I want to switch. And we're going to test this one. All right, so um, final thoughts for the DLC, and then I'm going to uh, leave. Uh, you know, I'm going to leave it. Um, now, the yeah, the art and the uh, whatever is amazing. A lot of the boss fights are good. Are like they're very visually uh, a spectacle. Um, the biggest issue really comes down to um and first off let me be clear i know all of this is supposed to be like post-game stuff the issue is there are uh there are a lot of instances where um the even just random enemy uh like damage and um and uh ability to instantly or nearly instantly kill you is it's it it's very shocking but it also becomes it becomes really tedious when random enemies can just deal like over half your health in damage right 
And this is coming from, like, yes, I have 18 blessing, but like, and yeah, I'm not wearing armor, but uh, there was a time where, like, I had these stats for a while when I was at, like, blessing six, and uh, I was down in, like, I was in the finger ruins of, you know, in here, and one of the lamprey enemies, like, it's on my channel, it, it's in the video while I'm there, um, one of the enemies there randomly hit me with a spell and took off, like, over three quarters of my health. And that was just, like, one single spell. And I had over 51% magic resistance. And I'm like, wait, you're telling me this is, like, half the damage this enemy deals? Like, are you insane? Like, that's where I think uh, it... Like, I don't know. Like, that's where some of the numbers feel a little too high in terms of, like, okay, I get it. Spells are supposed to hurt. But there's hurt, and then there's, like oh dear, this one-shots me. And this that, that kind of gets back to uh, what I was saying at the uh, up at the gate before uh, one of the Mikula fights, where this DLC really feels like um, instead of allowing you to sort of like make your own solutions, um, they give you all those larval tears because they almost like expect that, no, this is the way you're supposed to do it. Like, um... Especially because um, one of the reasons why I gave up on the quote-unquote like soul level whatever meta was because, well, when you think about it and go, okay, if you need 60 Vigor, which I'm going to say it like you probably do, especially your first time through, well, okay, if you're trying to play any kind of caster, well, you're probably going to want a lot of mind, and then you're going to need like 80 in Intelligence Faith whichever, you know, some combination of, like, well, you don't have a lot of stats left after that, right? And then, like, I'm... Now, first off, I will fully admit I'm the idiot who, for most of my playthrough, I've been trying to get the uh, the Prince of Death staff to work. I'm, like, almost there, quote-unquote. But, like, you know, like, it's... I really shouldn't be doing that. Like, and... But... And then, to be fair as well, it's you basically, like, don't have a lot of stat points left if you're, you know, when, when you're when you're looking at the math going, okay, I need 60 bigger. Um, if you're a build using more physical and whatever, you're going to need more endurance and physical stats. Well, you, you you don't really, you don't really have enough points, right? Like, you, you run out of road, and then if you're one of those people, it's like, no, can't level up after 150. Well, why not, right? Like, if the game keeps getting harder, why chop yourself off at the kneecaps and say, like, no, I can't level up anymore, right? Like, but regardless, um, yeah, final thoughts. I've enjoyed the DLC. Um, I definitely won't stream, um, if I do play, you know, more Elden Ring or, uh, like, take another character through the DLC or what have you. Um, and I would definitely, uh, um... I would definitely just use wikis or uh, whatever, because um, especially if you're having trouble, um, just look up where like scatter tree fragments and stuff are, or uh, um, pardon me, pieces of gear or whatnot, because uh, that that can really uh, make a big difference. Um, but yeah, anyways, I want to thank everybody so much for watching, and uh, yeah, I hope you've enjoyed the content or uh, you have enjoyed the dlc uh leave a comment down below if you finished and uh what your what your experience is like maybe what you know what kind of build you had and uh and yeah thank you all so much for watching and uh i hope to catch you all next time all right